I'm Alexis Newbert of Alexis Design, and I'm going to go over how to make a travel brochure. You want to use a layout program such as Adobe InDesign, something that incorporates both text and images. Start out by creating a new document. A standard trifold brochure would have two pages for the outside and inside of the document. Be a landscape orientation, eight and a half by eleven. And to create your panels, simply make a document that has three columns, give it a gutter of one half inch and margins all the way around quarter inch. And you'll see when we open this document that that really gives you three equal panels and that when it's folded, if we utilize these margins and these guides, you'll have all of your information, images, text centered in each panel or at least with equal margins around. So it can be helpful to, when you make a brochure, especially on the outside of it because of the way it's folded outside of the document space maybe to label each panel so as you're working you know where things are going to end up. This would be your inside flap if this were the outside. So that's the part. When you open it, it's here. The center panel on your first page is going to be the back of your brochure when it's folded. And then the right hand is what will be your front panel when folded. For the second side, it's pretty easy because once your brochure is open, you have those three panels as the inside. I like to start with the front panel. Usually you would put photo, pick a nice resort photo here, the title of your brochure or the name of the destina destination. Create a text box using your type tool on the left. You can select the text and choose a font from your top menu here. Choose the font size. Place it below. And then maybe below your image you would want to have some additional contact information the smaller type, address, phone, maybe a website, etc. I like to go in order from front, inside, and then move to the back. So as you move to the inside of your brochure, that's where the really the bulk of your information will be that people are going to read. You can drag and drop any additional images you might want in your brochure. You can have them large and run across more than one panel if you want. You can have them small so they only fit in one panel. And then you can use your type tool again to create additional text boxes inside your panels where your information can go. And then you can type away. Then you can move on to the inside flap where you have more room for additional images or more information. And the back of your brochure would generally be a repeat of your contact information, hours, you know, basic information there. And that's how you make a simple travel brochure.